Hey CCSU, let's log in to collaborate and go through some general features from the students or participants perspective. So they're going to access the link, they're going to type in their name, they're going to join the session, and the first thing they'll see is an audio test. So they're going to be able to choose their microphone and they'll see whether or not the microphone is working. Then they're also going to do a video test. So they're good to go, they're in the session. And now let's just point out the features that are, are available to the participant. First thing, over here we have the session menu. They could use their phone and get phone information to dial in if for some reason they can't hear anything. And then there's also some other features, reporting an issue or learning more about Collaborate. On the bottom middle, they have the ability to open up and agree with what you're presenting, disagree if you ask a question. They can ask to speed up, slow down, send a happy face, give you live feedback. They can say if they're away from the screen or not. They can tell you if they're back. They could also leave the session. The last option is their settings. So if there's ever an issue with audio or video, maybe they want to change something, they can open up their audio and video settings, do the setup camera and microphone, and they also can turn off notifications here if they don't want audio or noise or a pop-up. They have options here, whether someone's posting a chat or, or providing other. The other thing that people may want to know is they can click on their name and upload a picture of themselves. And it will save that once they upload it. They'll only have to do this once. Here's where they can unmute themselves. You can see the echo. Here's where they can turn on their camera. And then this is the raise hand. The last feature for participants will be the collaborate panel. So you click on the three arrows. Once we're in the collaborate panel, here's that settings feature again. This is the share content. Since this is the participant view. There's nothing for me to share. Here's the attendees where I can see everyone in the room. And then this is the chat panel where I can interact. I'll need to click on everyone. So now I'm chatting with the entire room. If I wanted to send a private message, I would go to the attendee panel and say I want a message the moderator, I'll click on the three dots and choose send a chat message. So there's a very quick overview